With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello student, uh, here the question given that the number of integers between 1 and 1000, 1000 having their sum of digit equal to 12. What is the result? So, you know, if we uh, collect uh, some number or numbers from the in numbers, suppose x1 plus x2 plus x3 plus dot 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 plus uh, suppose xr which is equals to n and here x uh, xi for all i equals to here i equals to 1 2 dot dot n okay so the number of a um, uh, whose sum is n is equals to the position of number of is that given by n plus r minus 1 c r minus 1 the total number of ways okay so here the total numbers of ways okay this is so now we using this fact we find the sum between 1 to 1000 whose uh, sum of the digits are equal to 12 okay so first of all we consider a set here we consider a set a name it a here we consider a is nothing here the three quantity x1 plus x2 x3 okay such that x1 plus x2 plus x3 equals to 12 where where all x1 x2 and x3 are greater than or equals to 0 so the total number of a here here some mistake here all numbers are greater than 0 that is xi greater than 0 for all i equals to 1 2 dot 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 r okay so here uh, using this law we have the total number of a here total number of ways here total number of ways are uh, here that is n that is n equals to 12 so here 12 plus number of digit here 1 2 3 so plus 3 minus 1 by c, no, sorry this c r minus 1 here r equals to what is r equals to 3 so 3 minus 1 so here we have that is 14 c 2 okay now now we consider a set we consider a set a dash which is like as x1 x2 x3 such that x1 plus x2 plus x3 which is equals to 12 but here x1 and x2 and x3 all are greater than equals to 0 yeah because this is a digit so so here x1 uh, is lies between the integer here consider integer 0 to 9 similarly for that is i for i equals to 1 2 3 because these are integer x1 x2 x3 are all integer so uh, so mm -hmm. that integer lies between must be 0 to 9 but here in this case in this case here x1 x2 x3 are all integer which is greater than 0 but here we consider this integer greater than only 10 so here we consider now a1 here a1 is like as x1 x2 and x3 such that x1 x1 here x1 plus x2 plus x3 which is equals to 12 but here x1 we consider x1 greater than or equals to 10 and other same for is greater than 0 and x3 greater than equals to 0 so here we apply the above theorem above the rules so here we have x1 minus 10 okay plus x2 plus x3 equals to here 2 okay so if we consider this is an x1 okay so x1 plus x2 plus x2 equals 2 so by the rule the total number of a choosing choosing of total number of a here that is 2 n equals to 2 plus 3 minus 1 uh, c r minus 1 that is r equals to 3 that is 3 minus 1 that is 2 so we have that is 4 c 2 Similarly, if we consider a set, if we consider a set A2, here A2 is nothing, A2 is same as x1, 
x2 x3 such that the sum the sum which is equals to 12 but x1 greater than 0 but x2 greater than or equals to 10 okay and x3 greater than or equals to 0 so total number of we here by the similarly way here we have 4 c2 also we consider the set a3 for the similarly we draw for the x3 okay so the sum of these three number equals to 12 but x1 greater than 0 x2 greater than 0 okay but x3 greater than equals to 10 x3 greater than equals to 10 so here the total number of a by the similarly way 4 c2 so that a a dash is nothing a dash is the sum uh, a dash is the union of that's two number so here a dash equals to a1 plus a2 plus a3 so that is 4c2 plus 4c2 plus 4c2 total number of this so that is uh, 4c2 is equals to 6 so 6 into 3 that is 18 okay now so this is 18 now here the restriction uh, if we see uh, the total number where we see where where this is a okay so a here a is a set where all integer are greater than zero okay all integer are greater than zero but that's in that integer li must be lies between because it is a digit so that must be lies between zero to nine but here we have calculated calculate that all the values of x1 x2 in or integer but which is greater than zero so if we subtract from a to a dash then we get where we get that result that that the sum of the digit is 12 okay so so total number of ways uh, of three digits sum of the three digit is 12 sum of three digit is 12 so that is a minus a dash so the ka, ka, the number of a of a is uh, what is this here 14 c2 14 c2 so that is 14 c2 minus uh, 18 14 c2 uh, factorial 14 by factorial 12 into factorial 2 so minus 18 okay equals to that is 13 into 14 by 2 minus 18 that is that is cancel out so here we have 13 into 7 equals to 91 minus 80 so we have 73 so the total number of ways is 73 this is my answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today